changing the batteries on your Curlin infusion pump. Your Curlin pump uses two C-sized alkaline batteries. Providence Home Infusion will supply your batteries. Changing the batteries. To replace the C batteries, pause any infusion in progress by pressing the pause key and then turn the pump off by pressing the blue on off button. Hold the pump so that the back of the pump is facing you. You will see either a slide lever or an open slot at the bottom of the battery cover. If you see a slide lever, then slide the lever to the right and pull in a downward direction to remove the battery cover. If you see an open slot, then slip a coin such as a penny into the slot and press in hard to release the latch while pulling in a downward direction to remove the battery cover. Remove the old batteries, noting the position of the positive poles of the batteries being at the top of the battery compartment. You will be pressing the negative pole against the spring in the bottom of the battery compartment. Insert the new batteries with positive poles at the top of the battery compartment. Replace and slide close the battery cover. If it is a slide lever pump, then press the slide lever to the, to the lock position. If your infusion was in progress, then turn the pump back on by pressing the on button. When program is highlighted, press the yes button. When resume is highlighted, press the yes button and then press the run button. When you see air sensor off, using an inline filter, press the yes button. That will restart your infusion and continue it from the point at which it was interrupted. Remember to always take an extra set of batteries with you whenever you leave your home. If your curling pump has an open slot at the bottom of the battery cover, then please only use a coin to release the latch and open the battery cover. We hope this video serves as a reminder of what your PIPS nurse taught you during your admission process. If you have any further questions or concerns, please call us so we can help.